Hello students, in this video we are going to find the difference between simple interest and compound interest. I have already uploaded a video on a detailed difference between simple interest and compound interest. In this video we are going to just solve a problem, find out the difference between simple interest and compound interest. So the question is, find the difference between the simple interest and compound interest on rupees 5000 for 2 years at 9% per annum. So in this question, we will first find the compound interest and then we will find the simple interest. Both the interest we are going to find using the formula. And then after finding the compound interest and simple interest, we are going to find the difference between them. So let's start by finding the compound interest. The formula we are going to use to find compound interest is first we are going to find amount which is P times 1 plus R upon 100 whole raised to power T where a is the amount which is rupees 5000 in our question, P is the principal, R is the rate of interest in percentage and T is time period in years. Here in our question we are going to find the amount first, principal is given as rupees 5000, rate of interest is 9% and time is given as 2 years. Substituting the values in the formula, A equals 5000 times 1 plus 9 upon 100 whole raised to power 2 which equals 5000 times our LCM is 100 that's going to be 100 plus 9 whole square that's 5000 times 109 upon 100 whole square which equals 5000 times 109 times 109 divided by 100 times 100. So amount equals, we'll simplify this, so these three zeros in the numerator gets cancelled in with the zeros in the denominator. So amount is 5 times 109 times 109 divided by 10. So amount comes out to be rupees 5940.5. This is our amount. Now we are going to use this to find the compound interest. So compound interest equals amount minus principal. Amount is 5940.5 minus principal amount is given as 5000. Compound interest is 940.5 rupees. This is our compound interest. Now we will find the simple interest using the formula. Simple interest equals P times R times T upon 100. Principal is 5000 times R is 9%, time is 2 divided by 100. So these two zeros in the denominator gets cancelled with the zeros in the numerator. So this is going to be 50 times 2 is 100 times 9 is 900. So our simple interest is rupees 900. So we got the value of compound interest and simple interest. Now we will find the difference between simple interest and compound interest. Compound interest minus simple interest equals 940.5 minus 900 which is equal to 40.5 rupees. This is our final answer. We are going to box the answer. So this is how we find the difference between compound interest and simple interest. I hope this video is helpful to you. If you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more math videos. Thanks for watching.